This next category is trailblazer, Jennifer Koziak. She's the professor of mathematics at UWL. So when we were sitting up here for about an hour in between suffering, I obviously was the only one who was nervous because they're quite eloquent. So I was talking and I had to associate something with the names and the bio so I wouldn't be totally, you know, put off guard here. So I thought, Jennifer Koziak, professor of mathematics, I thought, crazy. I'm gonna say Jennifer crazy in my head because I hated math. And I don't know how many of you, I would just break out in the sweats and just go into a panic with math. So I decided to tell her this, why I don't know, but she has such a great attitude and just so perfect. Such a good math teacher that she said to me, I said, well look, you know, I wanna tell you how I, how I remembered you. And I said, I hated math. I was so afraid, I'm sorry. So I thought you were crazy and she said, Oh no, you just haven't had the right teacher yet. She's like, you, you'd love math. Is that not like, that's exactly what she should say. And she said, plus, by the way, my students call me crazy act. I was like, oh, okay, so. Anyway, she's won so many awards. The 2010 Teacher edu Educator, excuse me, I can't talk, of the Year Award. 2012 UW System Regents Teaching Excellence Award. But most important, what she's most proud of is things like Math Family Fun Nights, I don't even think math and fun together, but she, she's on a mission. She's the president of the Wisconsin <coughs> Mathematics Council, and she's making it her mission for people like me and other women out there who are intimidated by math and science and go into different fields because they feel, you know what, it's not really for me. So she's changing the approach, and you can come up and accept your award, and I'm going to get tutoring lessons from you. <laughs>
around students who are eager to be challenged in their assumptions of well, how mathematics could be taught. And they really wanted to learn how to teach mathematics through mean meaningful context and engaging activities. And I have to say, because of those discoveries, I had to empower myself to rise to that challenge. So with the support of the members of my mathematics department, um, we were able to lead um, in the development um, of a robust mathematics curriculum for elementary, middle school, and secondary um, high school teachers, a role that has transferred, uh, transformed into the School of Education Secondary Teacher Education Preparation Program. Um, in these roles, I've been able to build strong relationships with teacher candidates from a variety of content areas. I always try to get them into math education, but sometimes they don't follow. Um, <laughs> but to really inspire the next generation of outstanding educators. Um, with continued support of education faculty, I am constantly challenged to revolutionize my courses, whether it's including social justice, um, whether it's including um, innovative technologies or just blending different content areas together. Now, my students may say that I innovate my curriculum uh, with math wraps. So we heard from Helen Keller, I'm now going to paraphrase Vanilla Ice. <laughs> Yo, YW, uh, YWCA, let's kick it. All right, stop. All right, learn. Just don't recall and listen. Jen is back with a brand new intervention, active learning. Grab the hold of you tightly. Build conceptual understanding daily and nightly. Will it ever stop you? I don't think so. I'll like Jen. They'll grow to the extreme. I walk the mic like a trailblazer. Let our future teachers watch them grow and become amazing. <laughs>